Okay, Dennis, we are we are live. Good. Mm-hmm. Look at that fire, huh? That's beautiful. Yeah. I'm eating popcorn by the fire. With my honey. <laughs> we got our our cool neon lights here. Not neon. What are they? LED lights? Are they LED? No, they're not LED. They're rope lights. They're LED, LED is different. Are they LED? Mm -hmm. Okay, so we've been here at this beautiful campground. It's called Prospect Mountain Campground in Granville, Mass. We pulled in here on Tuesday. Today's Friday. It's been quiet all <clears> week. <throat> and then on the weekend, everyone comes up here pulls their trailers and brings their tents or they come to their uh, their trailers that have been on site for the season and all the families come and everybody's having a grand, great time. So we, uh, we like the quiet time during the week and we love watching and meeting all the people that come on the weekend. So it's a great contrast. It's pretty fun. Yeah, so we've been enjoying some delicious meals that Dennis has been preparing. And, and my Blackstone griddle. Mm hmm And we were at the races for six days. Yeah, we were at Lime Rock Racetrack yeah. in Lakeville, Connecticut. And we, we bought a new hair grooming set. <laughs> Marianne never cut hair. And in the middle of my haircut, she said, she started laughing. <laughs> she says, I think you're going to be bald. <laughs> <laughs> so I got a new hairstyle. Look at the beautiful sky up there. So now you have to let me cut your hair. No, <laughs> no you wanted me to cut your hair. I don't want you to cut my hair. Oh. While I'm here, I'm going to make an appointment with Lynn. Lynn Breen. Over near where Tammy lives in Prospect. She does the best hair. She's awesome. Yeah. So we had our music going for a while. And Dennis put the, we put the screen house up. You can't really see it. It's kind of dark here now. But we got a beautiful screen house. We'll, we'll show you our setup during the day. Yeah, that's a good idea. And we're all set for company. We're, we're waiting for anyone and everyone that wants to come visit. The people that go by our place says, wow, you got a nice setup there. Yeah, we do. We have, we have it all set up. It looks beautiful. Inside and out. We're really comfy. We're living it up. Uh, so we'll be here for two months in this beautiful part of the country. Hoping to see as much as, of our kids as we can. Dennis is going to see his son quite a bit because he's going to come up and stay with us. Yeah. A few nights a week while he uh, he's doing some type of training that's closer to this place than it is to his home. Right. We're close to an Air Force base here. Oh, I see. And well, gas is what it is. I guess it's cheaper for him to stay yeah. with us. So that'll be nice. And I'll, yeah. I'll get to go down and see my girls and my grandkids and... Bring them up here when I can, and hopefully the family will come. We'll have a great time. Yeah. They have a swimming pool, which is nice. They have all kinds of kids' activities on the weekends. And that's fun. Mm. And we, you know, we traveled from being in Florida for five months, actually six, because we were down in Lake Geneva for a month. So we were in Florida for, let's see, November, we got in Florida in November. Yeah. Yeah. I don't remember when in November. Because, no. yeah, we were in Mexico. We were, we were at the we Bee Harvest. We took a left in Albuquerque in early November. Yeah, after we left the Beat Harvest. Well, we were at the Beat Harvest till November 3rd. And then we did the traveling, you know, we stayed a couple nights in Colorado and... Right. We went to New Mexico and stayed a couple nights, remember? We visited Judy and went dancing in the nightclub with her. <laughs> and we found out that we could boondock 
in this RV for six days. Mm -hmm. Five and a half, six days. Basically, if there's just the two of us, though. If we had a lot of people in and out, it would have been harder. You know, because the tanks would have really filled up and we would have ran out of water. But we did good. We did good. So it was wasn't bad but it was also nice to come and plug in because when you when you pull into a, a campground and you can plug in your electricity have your water flowing be able to take your showers in your RV be able to have the gray water which is the shower water and the sink water and everything just drain so you don't always fill it up and once a week you can empty the black tank <laughs> They come around and do it. Yeah. That's what we've got to get on their list tomorrow. Oh, okay. And I saw Joe, he has one of those honey pots. He was he was coming back from doing his, his dump with his honey pot. Oh he has attached a honey pot. to the back of his R V. I mean R V back of his his uh golf cart. Right. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. So anyway, life is good. We're enjoying ourselves. It's so peaceful here. Yeah. Look at the way the video is, is going. You can see it just in that just in that square. And then I don't know if you know what I'm talking about. It looks really cool. It looks different. I must have hit a different button. You know? Yeah. And, I'll, and it's showing like a blurred version of the fire underneath. Right. And it's showing the, the fire there in the middle. It's a beautiful fire. We have a wood fire tonight instead of the pellet. The pellet stove is right next to it. So we had that going for a little while, and then Dennis decided, hey, let's make a big fire in the, in the fire pit. It's beautiful. Yeah. So you have anything else you want to share? I'm just end up more in love with you every day. That's nice. <laughs> Am I a lucky girl or what? I still get coffee in bed every morning. It's really nice. Yeah. You, you, although, when you finally got ready to take a hike today, uh -huh. it was at my nap time. <laughs> it was late in the afternoon. Yeah. It's better to hike in the in the morning. We went to beautiful Granville State Forest, which is five minutes away. We're going to try the reservoir next time. Yeah. Oh, we're going to... Planet Fitness tomorrow. Planet Fitness. In, in West Springfield. Mm -hmm. Yep, and then we're going to do some grocery shopping, and we're expecting my daughter Tammy and Ryan and the two girls to come over and hopefully spend the night, and we'll have a great time. I'm so excited. That's what really gets me excited. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, it's been eight minutes. Eight minutes and 20, 30 seconds. Really? Yeah. Wow. I'm talking a long time. Huh? Mm -hmm. Well, it's, we miss everyone, but we're, we're doing what we want to do, travel the country in our RV, and we're having fun. And not, none of the stuff that we see on the news, we don't see it because we don't watch the news, but none of it's happening. Life is going perfect mm -hmm. out on the road. Everybody's having a great life. Mm -hmm. All these people come up here on the weekend and camp. And They're doing the best they can. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You can hear the kids. They're having fun, running in the dark. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, good night, everyone.